The next step of IVF is to perform an embryo transfer. This procedure is done in a transfer room near the laboratory. And we actually describe it, it's, it's quite similar to a pap smear and even less traumatic than a pap smear because when we transfer the embryo, we don't want there to be much um, uterine cramping. So there's a speculum just like a pap smear, um, and then the embryo is just um, placed very gently through the cervix and then towards the top of the uterus. We do that under ultrasound guidance, which is nice for both us to assure that it's in the right place and also for patients to see the flash of the embryo coming out of the catheter. It's quite um, gratifying to see that. In the past, when IVF was less efficient, more embryos had to be transferred to get a decent pregnancy rate. But with advancements in IVF, including uh, embryo culture techniques and selection of embryos, uh, we've shown that we can really achieve very high pregnancy rates, in many cases by transferring a single embryo, and, and have a better outcome for the patient.